I like that one up there. Alright guys, so I think we're just about to leave now. They just brought in, I think it was the last tender boat because it had all the food and, and security guards and everything else on it. And that island over there is pretty bare, so I think we're going to be leaving here very, very soon. Wow, what a gorgeous day here. What a gorgeous island. Cannot wait to be back. sail away um, what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna like sit down lay down and rest for just a minute um, I have no clue where my mother or my sister are. I like, ran up to, they went down to see about the art um, which told you about a gift card which I was thinking about it and probably they don't have anything under $200 so they're gonna want to suspend something so I don't know what they'll do um, or what they did they left uh, before I went up and watched sail away so I guess I'm gonna just kinda chillax in the air conditioning for a few minutes and um, probably getting ready for dinner right, here soon. Dinner, here is our menu for tonight. There's the wines. And over here we have the main courses. Something on the menu there. It's from the grill. Actually maybe getting something from that, I'm not sure. Sides tonight, and then the port of call is the key. Conch fritters and Caribbean pepper steak, which actually does sound good. Caribbean pepper steak, and then of course for an app charge for steakhouse selections. So I think over here I'm either gonna be getting this and this. But this also looks good. Thank you. Um, and then over here, the short ribs sound good, but I'm just afraid that they might they might be too fatty or something. They're good. Huh? I've had them. They're delicious. Are they fatty though? Because that's what I I don't want it to be like a you know a lot no, of fat on it and stuff. I've had them two or three times. They're good. Okay. And then. Um, the, like I said, the Caribbean pepper steak also sounds good. I'm just not, I'm not really keen on the side. Like it comes with um, tender strips of marinated steak, peppers, which is okay, red onions and pineapple. I guess I could do that. But then the fried plantains, I, I've never I, had it. It's good. Well, I just don't want, like I'm not in the mood for it. Do you know what I'm just not in the mood for it. So, yeah. So I don't know. I don't know what the heck I'm gonna get. So we've got our appetizer here. This is the chicken, I believe. Um, <laughs> does not look like what I was expecting it to look like, but it still smells good, so I'm looking forward to it. And then Mama, you got the ham, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, there's the ham. That that looks really rather elegant, actually. Mm -hmm. you, you know what that is? That's a chutney, it said. It is what? Chutney. Uh oh, I got her shrimp over there. <laughs> <laughs> Here's appetizer okay. number two. I got the fried shrimp. Um, the chicken was actually really, really good. That, what, what was it, marinated chicken or something? I don't forget what it was called, but it was really, really good. We really tasty. Look out on the menu when we leave marinated chicken tenders. Marinated chicken tenders, thank you. <laughs> it was excellent. So, um, I don't know if it had like a Caribbean flavor or what, but I would get it again, definitely. Here is our dinner for time. <laughs> How is it, Erica? <laughs> Rip into that piece of meat. <laughs> she got the, what did you get? The steak. Oh yeah, the Caribbean, the Caribbean pepper steak. And then she also got the chicken breast. Mama got the meat lasagna. Yeah, wow. It's good. Oh, it's really Looks good. good. Look at that. Mm. Wow. Yeah, it's such a good flavor. And then I got the short ribs and the green beans. I forget what that is, and mashed potato. So, I think it's gonna be a great, great meal. Looking forward to it. I can't believe we only have one more of these. <laughs> Don't remind me. And uh, you guys are seeing this a lot. Round two. <laughs> I, seem like, I feel like this is a reoccurring thing. 
Um, I thought the last cruise was the food cruise. You turned this into the food cruise. Right, like this is it. Oh, guys, here's our dessert menu. I'm so upset. <laughs> I'm so upset. <laughs> Let me know down below what you guys would have. <laughs> I really would like to have this, 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 <laughs> and this. <laughs> uh, I'm probably sick of just gonna have this. No! Yes. I have to, Mom. I have to. You can get no. all the other ones anywhere else. You no, can you only can't. get this one. You on. make the chocolate melting cake. Yeah, but I don't do it like carnival does. <laughs> you make. It's pretty darn close. I think I'm gonna get the melting cake. <laughs> They are so together tonight. I love it. This is the best they've ever done. Here is our dessert. Mama got the cheesecake. <laughs> I got, of course, the melting, melting chocolate. And Erica got her chocolate ice cream, famous for it. <laughs> there may be seconds of this. I want a second one. No. But I can't do a second no. one. I think we can. I no. can't do it. <laughs> no. How is the cheesecake? Oh, absolutely divine. Yeah, did it taste fresh? Yes. Oh, yes. Soft. I would say how was the ice cream, but ice cream is ice cream. All right, well, let's go figure out what the heck we're going to do now. Art. we got to go to the art thing. Oh, yeah, thing. that's right. We're going to go see what they say about the art thing. Okay. It's oh, a lot of art in here. Oh, otters, fox, haters. I like that one up there. You know, it's moments like these, right at sunset, that make you kind of stop and think about all the good that you have and how blessed you are, how really blessed you are. I came up top here just a second to look at the sunset and just look at the openness, you know, and, and this ship is really just like a tiny little piece in the ocean. You know, but it, it's got, it's got, what, 3,000 3, people on it, all heading to the same destination, but all coming from different places. It's just crazy to think about, you know. That was our little random uh, deep thought of the day. All right, I rushed back down here to find these two munchkins. <laughs> We're gonna get ready and go to uh Hasbro the game show. Um and we can go sit down at the lobby for a minute. I love that band that's playing. Oh my gosh, I love that band. Well we can listen to the band. We're gonna look at photos, remember? Okay. Alright. So we'll go look at our dinner photos and then we're gonna go to Hasbro the game show. Because we haven't seen it before. Alright, we just sorted through those photos. They did a great job then Hello. Sorry. <laughs> they did a great job, didn't they? We're going in here to Hasbro, though. I think it should be start. Yeah, it's starting right now, guys. Here we go. Oh no, it hasn't yet. Let's see. Oh yeah, we got a good seat. Play some of your family's favorite Hasbro games in a whole 
whole new way. The games are big, the fun is contagious, and the winning is just moments away. It's time to play Hasbro, the game show. This is the only cruise ship game show featuring Lana Gemini and Hasbro games and fantastic prizes brought to you by Carnival and by Hasbro. Folks, my name is Chloe, your host of tonight's show. Hats, good job. Caitlin down there with Lord Anthony. All right, Ellie with a winning shot today. Good job. She's going to go for the plane. Very nice. Ellie, color is going to appear on the box in front of you. One more time, your own individual color is going to appear on the box in front of you. Race car. Uh, it's fast like we were in Simon Flash, so I, I thought it was fitting. Oh, yes, very fitting. Now, do you think you can beat Parth right here? Uh, 17500 is pretty tough to beat. I don't know. Well, we're going to see what happens. I can't believe you're pulling the puppy dog eyes on him right now, you guys. All right, here we go. Can the race car beat 17500? Michael, can he win it tonight? Oh! Enjoy the rest of your evening and I'll see you all at 10 o'clock for the Love and Marriage Show. Again, I'm Chloe, your cruise director. I'm going to hang out with Pod, my hands for a winner. Enjoy your evening, folks, and don't go anywhere. Bingo is coming up next. Bye bye. sit down in that lobby guys and listen to them all night long seriously I can already tell you that's what I'm gonna miss most and that's never happened before on a cruise for me like the show band has not been the like main the most lovable thing for me but I absolutely I can't get enough of those guys what is it midnight midnight groove they are phenomenal such a good show band um, so right now we're gonna kind of um, we're gonna try and eat up some Wi-Fi. That's the one problem, and apparently Carnival's aware of it. But there's some issue with the Wi-Fi on the ship, and it just does not work. So we're gonna try and. That's why you haven't been posting your Instagram. Yeah, yeah. That's why there's been nothing on Instagram for me this week, because it will not post. It'll only post to Facebook, and only in like certain locations and certain times at, of the ship. So we're going to try and uh, post a little bit of stuff. If you're not following me on Facebook, it's Josh Hokum YT, J-O-S-H-H-O-C-U-M-Y-T. It's a uh, public page. You can press that like button. You'll get uh, regular updates from me, uh, as well as Mama Hokum. Uh, it'll be posted under my name, but she'll, she'll let you know if it is her ever posting. Um, but just updates, here's photos, you know, this is our next cruise, YouTube, um, that kind of stuff. So... Uh, make sure you go over, smash that like button, give it a like. 
And um, yeah, we're gonna take just a little bit right before, and then I don't know. Are you going to the love and marriage show? I don't know yet. Okay, I know I am. Uh, these two might rest up a little bit. We have a mega deck party tonight, so these two might be resting up just a little bit before then. Before anybody? Woo! Awesome. Well, I'm gonna make it a little bit different for you here today. I like to spice things up. So when you go on different cruises, it's never exactly the same. But don't worry, I still need three. <laughs> Fun, loving, crazy couples to join me. Hold on. How would you rate your first kiss? Nine. Oh, getting better at nine. A solid nine, but why not quite a ten? I mean, believe it or not, he's a little over the top, so. <laughs> Tell me, on a scale of one to ten, I know this was a while ago, but throwing back a little bit. <laughs> this is a throwback. How would you rate your very first kiss from one to ten? Definitely a ten. <laughs> Until you've seen. My wife's got <laughs> Someone's gonna be in trouble over there in a second. Chuck, I'm gonna start with you, my love. What do you think? You haven't seen ugly until you've seen my wife's brother. Her brother! <laughs> Is your brother really that ugly? Yeah. <laughs> he's honest, you got, he's honest, he's honest, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> Brian, I know you just got married a few hours ago. You haven't seen ugly until you've seen my wife's. Dwan, you are not allowed to say fingernails. Okay, you haven't seen ugly until you've seen my wife's. Well, I haven't seen anything ugly on my wife's, so I have no answer. Oh man, what a what a good deck party. They did actually really, really good with that one. That was one of the better ones I've seen. The, I don't think... Um, actually, probably Matt on the Vista. Chloe's really good. She's a really good cruise director. I, re yeah. I really like Chloe. I hope she gets promoted on a... If she wants to be, you know. Sometimes they want to stay on the smaller ships. There's <laughs> less they have... To, well, actually, this cruise, that's what somebody else in the elevator was saying is, you would think that they would, you know, just kind of half do everything and, and... Well, not half do, but there wouldn't be, like, as much entertainment. But they have got just as much, if not even just a little bit more, entertainment on this ship than they, as they do on, like, a seven-day, like, like the Breeze or the Vista or the Magic, something big like that, you know? So, and they pack just as much, like every show, like the Love and Marriage show, the Mega Deck Party, um, they had, what did they have yesterday? Well, they, they're having two playlist shows, they had comedy, I mean, everything, you name it, and they pretty much got it. Um, they, they didn't cut anything out, which is nice. I guess it means it's more work for them. Like Sarah, the girl that was just up there doing the Mega Deck Party Mom, that was the same girl that helped us this morning. In the lounge. And she was also the same girl that was out doing the tug of war on the island. I don't think I filmed that for you guys. Um, but they had like a little tug of war thing at like 2 o'clock. So that girl has been working literally all day long. Because um, she was in the lounge helping us this morning at what? 8, 30, 9 o'clock? Yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, that definitely more work for them. But 
We're going to go ahead and end it right here, guys. We've got uh, a kind of an early day tomorrow in, in Nassau, Bahamas. We're going back to Balmoral Island, where we, me and my mama were. Um, April. April. <laughs> I was thinking it was March. We were not there in March. We were there in April. Um, so we're going to go ahead and end it right here. We will see you guys tomorrow. Make sure you leave me that question down below of what you would have for dinner. Okay, guys? We'll see you in the morning. Show me your worst behavior. Don't want to preach your worst behavior.